So Eric Berry, you've played stages big and small. You've yes. played in groups, trampled by turtles. You've played solo. Mm -hmm. What convinced you to follow a life in music? Truthfully, it was always hard for me to answer like the what do you want to be when you grow up questions. Because um, somewhere along the line I learned that because I wore glasses I could never be an astronaut. And rather than thinking that was terribly unfair, it was just like, I feel, I feel like I have this memory of being 10 of just like, I don't have the entire world in front of me. Um, because there are just some things that are out of my hands and that's just the way it is. And so I just didn't know, I just figured I'd figure something out. I don't know, I was, when I discovered the guitar, I really liked that. My parents made me take piano, they made me take viola, they made me take saxophone. They would not let me quit any instruments and I hated it. And then I discovered the guitar and my father would tell you by that point I'd learned how to learn an instrument and I got pretty good at it. So that was always something I sort of wanted to do and I was very lucky in my high school to be able to do in addition to like playing in band or orchestra or whatever um, we, we had a computer music course and we had um, a composition course mm -hmm. and I would actually be able to like work the soundboard for like like my senior year I could work the soundboard for the freshman choir concert and learn how to set up microphones and stuff like that. So by the time I graduated from high school, I'd had quite a bit of experience in pr the production side of music and I had like, this, it, it, it gave me some pretty good ideas about how to go into it and I kept trying to quit because it's, it's a really dicey way to make a living, especially when you don't have, when you're not catching lucky breaks, um, which is, I don't want to take away anybody's hard work and dedication, but luck is such a part in my experience of what's going on with making it in music.